Ey, mi gente. got me so you know if the beat if the beat gets you it might be over with it might be over with so the beat got me this is carol g comma I'm well. Brr, brr. I'm well. <laughs> uh, and it's called couples so i don't know what that means maybe culprits or something i don't know we're gonna watch the video figure out what it's talking about but the beat got me so let's see what's on it popping the video it's kind of creepy already with the whole horns behind it if you if you know what i'm talking about but anyway let's keep going She need to chill out, man. She need to ch chill out looking muy bien, you know what I'm saying? She got to chill out muy frio. But I got a question. Why? What's up with the blonde hair? Like, she was so, she looked so Hispanic. I don't, I don't know if I should say Hispanic, but she looked so Latino. But now nah, she's like, kind of like a white girl. But what's going on? Let me know if y'all be noticing stuff like that. I'm going to rub back in my head, but let's keep going. <laughs> That is Unwell's go-to dance move. That little hot, bro. That hot. We we have found his go-to dance move because we. I don't think. I don't think Unwell got moves, man. Like I'm not gonna cap. Like let me know if y'all noticed that. Zone road if you got the go-to moves, but. You know what I'm saying? Let's bump all that. But you see how they switching back and forth? It's not a feature. Like, this is both of their song. Because it's that comma. So they might not be on the hook together. So we got to still figure out the comma and the X thing. <laughs> Carol G, out of all the female Latino Latina artists we reacted to, she gotta be, she gotta be top, top ten. But I don't think I've reacted to ten Latinas. But now nah, she probably top ten, maybe top five. I could be reaching, I could be gassing. I'm not too sure. <laughs> but let me know what y'all think. But this video was so weird, especially how they're positioning the horns behind her. It's kind of weird. But anyway, let's keep going. <laughs> Alright, so I think they are I think they are sharing the cause it's not like they're saying the same thing. So this is well, you know, this is like a hooky bass song, you know. I don't think it's saying too much. I think it's gonna have those little phrases and stuff that get you like oh, okay, yada yada. But it's not gonna be something that just like fucks your mind up where it's like, oh, they said that. I don't think I don't think a lot of music's been like that. I don't think music's been like that in a while. It's been very dumbed down, and I feel like it's actually affecting the culture when you make music that's like too simple. Anyway, uh, or too basic. Let's keep going. <laughs> It sounds trappy, and I'm I'm really impressed how her vocal can fit it. Like how she's able to find those pockets for herself to to sing on this, cause she's not really rapping on this. But only well, he's gonna fit it because it's a trappy beat. But what I think that what I call this beat, it's like trappy emotional. You see, it's kind of like the notes are kind of elongated the melody a little bit. You know what I'm saying? It's just like it has that that emotional effect to it instead of it being like this is the lifestyle that I live. Let's keep going. Mm -hmm. 
Do like a low rap, a little, you know, a little switch up in her, her, her vocal, and she finna hit us with like she changed, like she went up like an octave on her voice. And I'm like, you gotta you need to chill out, like chill, oh, 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 chill out, can we? we know you can sing, Shawty. We know, we know, nosotros sambamos. Interesting. I think that Car Carol G got to be signed to somebody, and Anya Well, I feel like he's moving really weird now since he got out. He's been like, I didn't know Anya Well before, but like based on the music he started with and like how he's like doing now, I feel like something happened to him. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, let's keep going. <laughs> Baby, 